To begin smoke evacuation mode, the disposables needed include the bifurcated smoke evacuation tube set, two conventional trocars, and a varus needle if the surgeon desires to insufflate with one for the initial insufflation process. The tube set consists of a filter housing and dual lumen tubing which features a clear tube for insufflation and a blue tube for smoke evacuation. The air seal filtered tube set features two ULPA filters. Completely insert the bifurcated smoke evacuation filter into the IFS unit by holding the dual lumen tubing where it's connected to the filter, oriented upright at the 12 o'clock or top position. Then push the locking lever down until it stops. The IFS will automatically detect the corresponding tube set and launch into smoke evacuation mode. Set the desired flow rate and pressure values. Because the two trocars needed will be several inches apart, you will need to partially separate the clear and blue tubes from each other. Insert the first trocar or varus needle and connect the clear tube to its stopcock. Press the Start button on the touchscreen display to begin initial insufflation. When the insufflation is stable and after the first trocar is inserted if using the varus needle, insert the second trocar and wait for the touchscreen display prompt to ask you to connect the blue tubing. With both the clear and blue tubes now connected, smoke evacuation is active and filtering the intra-abdominal gas while removing smoke throughout the procedure. The flow and smoke evacuation level will adjust automatically to maintain a stable pneumoperitoneum while filtering smoke. At the end of the procedure, press stop prior to disconnecting the filter tube set from the IFS unit and powering off the IFS unit. Please proceed to the next module for more information. <music>